Now for this question then, we've got our curve where x is greater than or equal to zero. We've got it sketched here and we've got this shaded area r which is bounded between the curve, the line x equals root two and the x-axis. And we've got to work out the actual area of r. We've got to show that that area of r is equal to half the integral from two to four of u minus two natural log of u du using this substitution, u equals x squared plus two. So how are we going to do this? Well, first of all, area bounded by a curve to the x-axis is normally given by the integral of y with respect to x, where your x limits go, in, in this case, from naught to root two. But this doesn't look anything like what we've got up here we can see that it's an integral with respect to u. It's got u's in here. So how are we going to get around this problem? Well, we need to change the variable. We've got y, okay, we've got y, but dx can be changed to dx by du as long as I put a du there. It's as if those two cancel out, give me y dx, the same as what we've got here. But now we're integrating with respect to u and our limits need to be changed. They need to be changed to u limits and we can do that through our substitution here. So if we come down here we can say that when x equals naught, okay, our lower limit here, substitute it into here and you can see that u equals naught squared, which is naught, plus two, so it's two. So when x is naught, our lower limit is now two. And we take our upper limit, root two, when x equals root two, we can see that therefore u equals root two squared, which is two, plus another two, and that's going to be four. So there's our upper limit. Now, We've got our integral then going from two to four. We've got y. Y is equal to x cubed, okay? Natural log of what is effectively u. u is x squared plus two. So I'm going to fill that in as the natural log of u. So that is essentially y in terms of x and u. We now need dx du. So what's dx du going to be? Well, I can find out what du by dx is by differentiating this up here. So du by dx would equal 2x. Okay, if we differentiate the x squared, 2 obviously goes to 0. But we want dx du, so we can reciprocate this. So we've got dx by du equals 1 over 2x. So we can pop that in there as 1 over 2x. I'm going to put brackets around the natural log of u. I want to separate it from the 1 over 2x. And then we've got this integrated with respect to u. Now what I notice is that this x here can cancel out with the x cubed, leaving me with x squared. So what I have now is this half, which can come out the front of the integral. I've got the integral going from two to four, and now I have just got x squared. But what is x squared? Well, from here, x squared equals u minus two. So I can pop that in as u minus two for x squared. Then we've got the natural log of u, integrated with respect to you. And that's what we had to prove. All right.